Hey everybody, welcome back to NMAP Network Scanning Basics and Advanced Techniques. This section we're going to take a look at scanning IPv6 addresses using NMAP. Okay, this time I uh, there are going to be some differences with this particular lesson because uh, instead of using my Kali installation and trying to hit scanme.nmap.org on their IPv6 address, um, I went ahead and uh, created a cloud server that would allow me to, to do this that came with an IPv6 address. So if you remember, we... Uh, Originally, we're doing some uh, doing our initial scans. Nmap noted that there was uh, two IP addresses for scanme.nmap.org, and that was we had an IPv4 address 45.33.32.156, as well as an IPv6 address. And I mentioned we would go back and look at scanning IPv6 addresses, uh, and that's that's this section here. There were a couple of reasons why we want to go and do that type of scanning. Um, one is, you know, firewalls are, you know, set up. You have to do rules for IPv6 and IPv4. And so it's very possible that somebody has set up a server that, or excuse me, a firewall rule set that does not include rules for IPv6. You may find you get access to other services. You may very well find that uh, as you're scanning your environment, you have different services popping out on IPv4 versus IPv6 in general. Um, and so, you know, that's that's what, some of the reasons why we would want to go ahead and do this type of scanning. So doing this scan is actually really simple. Um, logged in as root, and so we'll be able to do uh, scans without worrying about uh, not doing SIN scans or whatever. But to do... a an IPv6 scan, you just add a minus six to the nmap command as our option, and then the domain name. And the minus six tells nmap, hey, I want this to be done over IPv6. And so we go ahead and hit enter. Let this run for a few seconds. All right, and we have our output. So a couple of things show us right away that are, that are different. One, um, it's now saying that it resolved scanme.nmap.org to this IPv6 address. So we know that we're definitely you know, hitting the, the right address at this point. And if you remember before, we had four open services on IPv4. There was a NPing echo uh, service, uh, I think on like 9,920 or something like that. Um, and on IPv6, we have three services only. 2280 and 31337. So that's just an example of what can occur, uh, you know, different services popping up. Now, if I wanted to do this by IP address, we're just going to go ahead and copy this and just do uh, nmap minus six, give it the IP address, and let it go. And there you go. So pretty straightforward, just add the minus six to hit IPv6. All of the other options are gonna be pretty much the same uh, that we would be dealing with because the, the protocols are, TCP protocols, UDV protocols are all the same. They're just listening on different address space. So hope that helps. Uh, just if you have this in your environment, again, encourage you to run some scans with it, see what you find. Thanks and we'll talk to you next time.